guys, it's me, Leia, and today we're at the mall to go to the Apple store. And no, my phone is not broken. Well, it kind of is because my Apple ID won't work, and I can't update stuff, and I can't download stuff. So we're going to go get that fixed. So let's go. It's so funny. My wallpaper. <laughs> Leia's wallpaper is the Leia making a super weird face. I put that on there. She, I saw it in a video, so I screenshot it and put it on. Her. On one of our videos? No, it was on one of her TikToks. Oh, from TikTok? Yeah. Oh my goodness, <laughs> Leia. Do you want them to see that? Sure. You do? Yeah. You don't care? Okay. All right, Leia doesn't care. <laughs> I told her to change it, but she doesn't care. So yeah, we're going back to the Apple Store, guys, for another iPhone video. So guys, look like. Oh yeah, go check out Maya's, well, it's not her page, a fan made it, it's called, what is it called? Maya Ray's Closet. Two E's. We'll put it on the screen, but if you guys, I know a lot of you ask about her clothes and shoes and where she gets them from, and it tells you guys her outfits and where she got them and the prices. Maya Ray with two E's Closet. So is there an S? Um, no. It, Just Maya Ray? Yeah. So this is the Instagram page. And I have a lot of new Instagram pages. How about we do a shout out every video for our Instagram page? Because I have a lot of ones that make good edits and soon I'm gonna start making videos on like like reacting to their edits and like Okay, so we'll do a shout out for Maya's um, fan accounts or edit accounts for every video that you're in. You have to remind me because I'll forget. You'll probably forget too, but we'll try. Yeah, we'll try. No promises. We're gonna try extra hard. Back to the phone. Oh yeah, so Alea's phone isn't broken, but it kind of is broken. She can't use it, so would you consider that broken? Yeah, if, if I can't download stuff or updates. So. Yeah, so it's in a sense it's broken, but we're going to the Apple store. Do you want to walk this way? Yeah. But, um, yeah, in our last video, guys, you guys thought that Maya, like all the comments are, Maya's irresponsible, she doesn't take care of her phone, she doesn't need a new phone. You guys just assumed that she broke her phone. That phone was not for Maya, guys. That was for me, for my five-year-old phone. I was just getting a new one, updating it. This is my she phone. still has her still iPhone 8 Plus Red. Not cracked. She's taking care of it. And like, all the comments were that you weren't taking care of the phone. I tried to respond to as many as I could, telling them that... The first thing I want to say, the first time I broke my... The first two times I broke my phone wasn't even because of me. It was because we were outside messing around. That's well, someone else broke your phone those times, That's but yeah. it kind of was your fault because you were messing around. Yeah, but, but, man, but yeah, it was not Maya's phone, guys. It was my five-year-old phone. I was just updating it. It's kind of like an extra phone, I guess you would say, right? Yeah. And it stopped, like, working, too. Yeah. Like, like the LCD screen. Yeah. So, yeah, all those comments, I tried to respond to, like, everyone, but I couldn't, telling them that Maya had, if you guys paid attention in the video, Maya had her phone the whole entire the time. Whole time. Hand. in her hand and she was on it the whole time so yeah guys Maya still has her phone she's taking care of it she's being responsible Alea has had her iPhone SE for a super long time she takes extra good care of her phone but we don't know what's going on with the Apple iTunes ID so that's what we're gonna get fixed we're at the mall where do you want to go in at this way all right so we're gonna go in this way and we'll let you guys know the update of getting Alea's phone fixed. If we get it fixed, what was wrong with it? You want to jump in, Alea? Yeah. One, two, yeah. three. <gasps> Maya! <laughs> if you would have pushed her in, I would have cried. She probably would have cried. Would you have cried? No, I would have laughed. It's like a wishing I pond. I would have, every single penny that I jumped on, I would have crushed on its wish. Alea would have been rich if she would have fell in. Yeah. <laughs> this is, um, we were here, all of our friends went to the mall. There was this kid, David, and he threw his phone in here. Did he what? go get it? Because they were throwing it throwing it around, and like, he was over there, and my friend was up here, and they were like passing around being so stupid, and the one kid thought it was a hit in the face, so he ducked, and he forgot there was a pond behind him. And so how did he get his phone out? The security came and got it out, but now it's all the way up on that roof, because then they figured like, it was his second phone. It wasn't his like real phone, he just had it for like emergencies. Like a backup phone? Yeah, and they threw it up on the roof up there. So it was in here. <laughs> They got it out. Got now it's up there. It's still you did? Look. Ah! <laughs> All right, let's go before Maya really puts Alea in the pond. <laughs> oh,
Maya wants Chick-fil-A, you guys know that's her favorite. Every time I tell someone to guess what she's gonna eat, they always say Chick-fil-A. So after we leave the mall, we're gonna get her some Chick-fil-A. Analea, what are you gonna get? Um, tacos. Tacos? Yeah. From where? Anywhere. Taco Bell? Yeah. Is there a Taco Bell, Bell around here? I want tacos and quesadillas. So Alea has an unpopular opinion, guys. She does not like Chick-fil-A's chicken. She thinks it tastes weird. How can you think Chick-fil-A's chicken tastes weird? Oh, wow, it's so good. If you guys like Chick-fil-A, <laughs> comment like down below. Dog. Or if you don't, comment down below so we My know everyone's friends. opinions on it. Well, Ian and Emma, we're like obsessed with Chick-fil-A. It was Friday. This past Friday? Yeah, and Courtney's sister brought me and Emma and Courtney Chick-fil-A. She's gonna bring it for us Monday and Tuesday again. So Maya gets catered to at school. Her friend's sister brings them Chick-fil-A at lunch. Me and dad have brought you Chick-fil-A before. Yeah. A few times. And then you brought me Olive Garden once. Olive Garden. Yep. For my Maya school, gets spoiled allowed, at school. Yeah, you're allowed to bring your kids lunch and stuff, like from different places, or you can eat outside with them. Because there's outside umbrellas and stuff. Yeah, so at Maya's school, is your school like that too? Yeah, I think, like, I don't know if you have to sign something. We probably have to sign up for it. Because last year, Serenity, um, and Dad came, and then I... Oh, when Serenity was I visiting. I outside with them. Yeah. Oh, here's the Apple oh, Store. I didn't get to finish telling them, but at Maya School, guys, you can go bring your kid food. You can go there and eat with them. It's really cool, but yeah, we're here now. Maya's going to walk around. You have your phone, so we'll let you know when we're done. There's okay. Siri. Here's some drink. Did you do that? All right, I'll call you when we're done. Make sure you answer your phone. I don't know if it's the right email address. It's usually an email address. Yeah, that's not the right email address, no. Because no. we were having trouble with it. That was just another email address that we put on there, but that's not what we started out we're just, with. We're going to use that one for now, okay. so they have an easy way to basically try and pull up all the other Apple IDs. Okay, so all right. Back to you. Thank you. And the phone number that you can be reached out right now? Yes. Awesome. Apple Support's going to give you a call momentarily. It's usually an 800 or an 866 number. Okay. Uh, you can just walk around the mall, and they'll just ask you a couple questions. Okay, right? and I don't have to come back? Nope. All right, thank yep. you so much. Excuse me. <laughs> so that was super simple, right? Super simple. Alright guys, so he's going to have Apple support contact us and he's going to call us. We're going to walk around the mall. We don't have to stay here, so that's a good thing because you guys can see like how crazy it is in here. So we're going to go wait for the phone call and hopefully we can figure out your broken iTunes ID issue, right? Yeah. Oh my gosh, that screen. Oh, I think they're calling me now. Oh, they did. Oh, that is. Hello. So we're going to sit here right in front of the Apple store and <laughs> while I'm on the phone with Apple. So Leia's going to go play with Siri right there. I'm going to sit right here in front of the Apple store and try to figure out her Apple ID. She's like obsessed with that Siri thing. If you guys saw our Best Buy video with our shopping for MacBook video, she didn't want to leave it. <laughs> I don't know what the big deal is about it, but she loves it. That's a typical weekend day in Apple, guys. Super packed. Thank you. Okay. All right, guys, so we reset the password and did a few things. Did not work. Now this message is popping up, and Alea said this is how it all started. Your account has been disabled in the App Store and iTunes. So that's pretty much what we're here for. They said that they were going to transfer me over to iTunes and verify that it's us and get your phone working again, all right? All right. So I'm just waiting on hold now. Hopefully we can get it fixed.
T-T-W-E What just happened while I'm on the phone with Apple? So we met a fan and she asked, us to, she asked me to take a picture with her. So I took a picture with her. So I was on the phone. I didn't get to talk to her, but whoever she was, hi. <laughs> and thank you for stopping and saying hi to Alea and getting a picture. <laughs> so I just got off of the phone with iTunes and Alea's phone's working. How excited are you? Let's go from 1 to 10. I break the 10. <laughs> you don't have a pointless or useless iPhone anymore. She couldn't do anything with this before. Like literally everything was disabled and blocked. So now she can play Fortnite again. And like we were saying before, a fan came over and took a picture with Alea. And I hope she didn't think I was ignoring her. I was on the phone with iTunes, but that was nice of you to come up and say hi to us. Oh, thank you. Do you want to be on the video? So here she is, guys. She came back. <laughs> Are these all your friends? Mm -hmm. What's your name? My name's Abby. And you live here? Yeah. Thank you so much for saying hi to us. You'll be seeing this vlog up probably tomorrow. Thank you. Bye. They're so nice. Thank you. I want to download something. Okay, go ahead. Let's okay. See, this is the test right here. So we put the password in. And she's gonna test it out. Open. Yay. Okay, uh, they can send me notifications. Fonts for Instagram. I've never heard of that before. What Did you want to download that? Yeah, I want to... It um, was upside down. It says upside down at the top. I want to um, get one for... Wait, is this only for Instagram though? Because I want to get it in my text messages. Oh, okay, like a different keyboard. Yeah, because right, that's so, what started the Yeah, it works now. Yay! High five. High five. All right, guys, so that is the end of our vlog for today. If you enjoyed, please give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe if you're new and comment down below. If this ever happened to you and your iPhone, it was a huge hassle, but they gave us free movie credits for iTunes for all the inconvenience. Yay. <laughs> so that sounds good. So we'll be using those. Thank you, iTunes and Apple, and we will see you guys on our next video. Bye! Bye.